Dylan Mulvaney has been violently threatened by American TV personality dog The Bounty Hunter after he made threatening anti-trans remarks about her on a live stream. Dog The Bounty Hunter is a famous bounty hunter who, in 1976, was convicted of third-degree murder and sentenced to five years in a Texas prison. In a brand new religious Facebook live stream, Dog repeatedly misgenders Dylan and threatens to physically hurt her. All led to Bud Light. Get that punk down, rebuke Satan out of him, and just give him a couple black eyes. <laughs> Exactly, and I mean that. If I ever see him, I'm dropping him. Dog's queer daughter, Lisa, apologized on her father's behalf, telling TMZ, I would like to send my apologies to Dylan and the trans community as a whole, and her heart breaks over Dog's hateful comments. In a new TikTok, Dylan reveals she had to leave her country to feel safe. It's a little sad that I had to leave my country to feel safe, but that will get better eventually. But then later denies that it had anything to do with the ongoing transphobic abuse. Dylan Mulvaney is back in the news today. She has left the United States because she no Dylan Mulvaney flees to South America. Have we never heard of someone taking a vacation before? This all started when Dylan revealed the truth about Bud Light, claiming they abandoned her amid the transphobic backlash she received after promoting their brand. In a recent TikTok, Dylan reveals she has been harassed and even followed by strangers in public since her Bud Light video went viral in April 2023. And I was waiting for the brand to reach out to me, but they never did. And for months now, I've been scared to leave my house. I have been ridiculed in public, I've been followed, and I have felt a loneliness that I wouldn't wish on anyone. Dylan explains how Bud Light have done nothing to support her during this time. For a company to hire a trans person and then not publicly stand by them is worse in my opinion than not hiring a trans person at all. On April 1st, Dylan posted a sponsored video to her Instagram, announcing herself as a Bud Light partner. The video was quickly found by conservatives who called to boycott the beer. Since then, Dylan has not admitted to what happened behind the scenes. Fans rushed to Dylan's comments, flooding them with love and support during this time. Just last month, Dylan announced they would take her personal transition offline following the intense backlash and widespread hate that came her way.